You got a new listing. Congratulations. Now it's time to put it in the MLS and more importantly, put those beautiful pictures in the computer and upload the video you may have made of the property. Let's try it. And remember, do it within one to two days or the MLS police will be on your back. So let's start with the basics. To do so, you go to either My Matrix or the Ad Edit. My favorite way to do it is go to My Matrix. So I go to My Matrix, then My Listings, and under My Listings, in this particular case, the one we're going to do happens to be a residential income. So I have to go to My Active Residential Income Listings, and I found it. Once I'm there, I can either hit the little pencil button, which is Edit, or I can click on the box that, for this listing and then hit edit. Or I can hit manage photos once I do that. And that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hit manage photos. So once I'm here, this is an actual listing, so I've deleted them, but we're gonna put in a few others so we can show you how to do that. So here we go. Once you're here, you hit browse. And then in this particular case, I'm going to find the pictures desktop and the property in particular happens to be on 79th which I've labeled it that and there we go so you can pick as many of you as you want so here we go and now they're loading thank goodness there wasn't too many but it does take a little bit of time so be patient if you see the little green bar going across you know you're you know you're progressing in the right direction You got it? Perfect! We got it! Yes! Alright, see you later! Bye! Woo! Hey! <laughs> now that it finished loading, finally, it does take a while. Once it's done, you can go ahead and edit the pictures, change the order, delete a picture if you didn't like it. So let's just try that a little bit. So again, you can take this picture if you like it more and move it around. I can do that over and over. So we're putting it in the order you want. I like to say I'm telling a story. So what kind of story am I trying to tell the client that's looking at these pictures? And that's the purpose. So really easy to do as you can see. I put the videos in a particular order as if I'm telling a story of the property, as if the person is walking through the home and you want to let them see it as they wouldn't see it if they were seeing it in person. Once you're happy with the order, then go ahead and hit certify and save. Now that we've got the pictures handled and in the MLS, now let's work on uploading the video. So if the marketing department or Joey went ahead and made a link for you, go ahead and upload it to your YouTube page. Joey or yourself can do so. Once it's there, you go to YouTube, you copy and paste the link, and you put it in the MLS in the particular place it needs to go. Let's show you how to do that. First, I go to YouTube. And then, when I'm on my YouTube page, we go here to your channel, which is here. And then once you're on your channel, you go to videos. So then, once you have the video on the screen, once you have the video on the screen, you go ahead and hit the share button, copy. You go back to the MLS, you go to edit by hitting the pencil or clicking on the box and hitting edit, either way. You go to residential income or if it's residential you hit residential. You go to the description page and like always you have the, the description that the consumer will see or that will be in the MLS 
and then you have the description that will be on consumer websites such as Zillow and in this particular case you can add your phone number there and it's totally legal because that's what's going to be on Zillow and Realtor.com and other other ones so here we go so I have the branded version so I'm going to put the branded one right here under the virtual tour URL branded go ahead and click it and I paste and voila it is there I hit the submit button and now it's there permanently we're going to do the same thing for the MLS unbranded version you, have, you open it up click on the share button hit copy and paste you hit copy of course and we're going to continue editing and this time we're going to do the unbranded version where your agent or broker information can't be found same thing as easy as that click the submit button now your branded and your unbranded videos are in the MLS question that comes up a lot is how do you even find the video once it's in the MLS so we're gonna to go to the property I'm just gonna merely find the property as if I was an agent that didn't have this listing I found it and once you're on the page and it loads the video link is right here so here's the virtual tour video link, the unbranded one since we're in the MLS. Click on it. The client or the agent can view it. Again, when you're in the MLS, only the unbranded MLS version will show. Your branded version will not be in the MLS. All right, guys. Thanks for watching the video today on how to upload pictures and your YouTube video. Have a good one.